Hey guys, uh, Mike with Insane Solutions uh, here again. Um, on this video, we're going to talk about how to create your menu uh, to go up here. I'm going to walk you through exactly how to get this set up and get this um, working on your site. Um, I went ahead uh, off camera and set up all the pages just like I did on the first video showing you how to create your home page. Uh, basically, what I did was I just went back through and I created brand new pages. Let's go over here to pages and you'll see I created a brand new page, one about blog, one about or one about page, one a blog page, one contact page, one home page, one product page. You know, these these are the pages, the the brand new pages that I was talking about in the first the first video of how to set these up. And basically all I did was I just followed the same instructions for the home page. Um, to create each one of the pages for the Jack Oliver theme. The home page, went in, created the page, named it, made sure the template was set to Jack Oliver template, and uh, copied in this into the text format, and then repeated the process for each page. Okay? Uh, so now what we're going to do is we're going to create a menu to go with these pages, to, to link them to these pages. Very easy to do. All you have to do is come down to Appearance on the left-hand side. Come down to Appearance. Just let, just hover. Don't click. Just hover over. And you'll see a, a menu pop out on the side. Go to Menus right down here under Widgets. Click on that. And now you're going to go right up here to the top. It says Select a Menu to Edit. And then it gives you a drop-down list of whatever menus you have set up. Or you can create a new menu. This is what you want to do is you want to create a new menu. And like I said, this is for people that already have pre-existing blogs set up. They're already set up on a template, you know, and they're wanting to just transfer over to the Jack Oliver theme setup. Just create a new menu. Now you're going to need to name this menu, menu name, and we're going to do it uh, one um, Jack Oliver theme menu. Okay, very simply. Now what we're going to do is going to create. The, click this red button that says cre uh, create menu. Now, you want to make sure whatever pages you're putting in here, you want to select them. Select them over here on the left-hand side. So the first one we want is our home page. Uh, then we want the about page, product page, blog page, contact page. Now we're going to add these to the menu. Now they're all mixed up right now. They basically they they went by. Um, alphabetical order pretty much so what you want to do is you just want to click on it and hold and then drag that drag it over and position it however you want them to look so we got home about contact on the bottom products next or yeah products next and then blog and then contact that's all you have to do to set those pages up you just simply select you know, you'll scroll through all your pages that you have over here. If you don't see them, if you're on the most recent tab, just click on View All, and it'll show you every page that you have created inside of WordPress. And then you just select the pages that you want, drag them over, or uh, add, click Add to Menu, and then position them however you want to position them. Make sure that you do not have this box right here checked. Automatically add new top level pages to this to this menu. If you do, every time you create a new page, it's going to automatically add it to the menu, and you don't want that. Uh, your display locations right here. You want it in uh, main primary menu and footer menu. Okay. Uh, you can also select the mobile menu. It's up to you. Um, and then save the menu. Now, once you have that selected, now all you have to do is go go to your site, 
you'll want to go to the customize button right here at the top and you want to come over to this little tab right here that says menus you want to select it and now you're going to have it's going to ask you uh, which menu you want to use uh, da, 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 let's see here okay um tell me that okay it, it's going to automatically add that menu to it right here you see how it says one home page one about page one products page one blog page the reason why it looks like that is because it is set up with um but it, it automatically saves it just like you type you typed in the the title but you can change the way it looks all you have to do is find the menu that you just created click on it come into it let it you know click the drop down and you can change how it looks right here so if you want it to just say home instead of one home page you can type in home and as soon as you type it you see how it changes here you know so that's that's how you can change it even though your page is named one home page you can change the the label right there very easy to do um, and then you'll just once you get them all set you just uh, just click on the publish button right here and that sets your pages throughout the theme for the Jack Oliver theme I hope this has been helpful. Uh, it, you know, if you're needing any extra help or on anything, please leave me a comment. Uh, you know, let me know what it is that you're needing help with, and I will create a training video on that. Thank you, uh, and we'll speak again soon. Take care.